Hey guys, today's video is more about how to open an app when you've downloaded it, especially from the internet. Um, this happens to be for the Nexigo 1080p FHD autofocus webcam for the N660P um, webcam model. So with this camera, while it's better than the installed webcam on the computer, laptop computer, I still can't adjust the exposure, it's just too automatic for me. So I want to control the brightness or the saturation. You can get one from the iTunes, uh, the App Store. Um, however, you got to pay for it. So I'm hoping that there is one available on their website, which I heard there is. And I don't know why they don't make it more obvious to do so. So go to nexigo.com, N-E-X. Igo.com. Uh, this will change to nexipc.com, and then you will go down to the bottom of the website where it says Nexigo Webcam Downloads. Oh, they should probably make that bigger. I think this is so important. Um, go ahead and click on this. Okay. Um, so the first part of this video is to show you guys where to get it because. They are not very obvious about this um, on the packaging. So you can go ahead and download this. I clicked on the Mac one because I have a Mac. If you have a Windows one, click on that. You'll see in the bottom corner from this browser uh, for Chrome, it downloads here in the bottom left-hand corner. This is the package I just downloaded. Again, you can buy different ones, like for eight bucks, you can buy webcam settings from the app store but i want to try a free one right i just paid 70 bucks for this webcam so i don't want to buy any more stuff so i'm going to click on this package here and look what happens it says the nexico setup mac package can't be opened because it is from an unidentified developer now mac wants to control what you open on your computer for safety's sake it's also a big pain in the butt so how do you open this thing if you trust Nexico's website or whatever website you're on. Press OK and it disappears. So how can you open it? How can you install the software? Go to your Apple icon to the top left hand corner of your screen. Press your mouse. Go down to System Preferences. This is the inner workings, like a menu for your computer. Go to Security and Privacy in the first row. I believe on my other laptop, Security and Privacy is located elsewhere. So find this icon, it's a little metal house. Click on that. Now it may show up to Privacy or Firewall. Click on General. Um, okay. And then you want to go down to the second half of this panel here. It says Allow Apps From, and look at this where my mouse is not pointing to. Next it go set up Mac. That's the package I want to open is a block from opening because it is not from an identified trusted developer. I'm going to press open anyway. Okay, so sometimes this will happen. You can go ahead and open it. Okay, or you can press the click here and you can press that padlock and then you can make changes and open the package that way. So I'm going to press open anyway and open. Now I'm going to be able to install this package or whatever app you're trying to install on your computer. Just make sure it's something that everyone is able to use and it's from a trusted source. Okay, so it just installed successfully. Let's take a look at this. I'm very excited to see if this will work. Okay. So here it is. Here is the app. I'm going to click on it. Ah, look at this. This is my webcam and all the parameters are here where I can change the sharpness, the saturation, the hue. This is a huge selling point for this camera, uh, this um, webcam. I think they should say it comes with our own app. Um, if you get the Nexigo webcam and you don't download this app because you don't know it exists, um, it's going to really enhance your experience using this camera because you can control how it looks depending on how much sunlight is coming through your room, what studio lights you have. So I hope this helps you not understand, not only understand how to better use your webcam, where to get the download, and that even there is a download, and how to open and install that download on your computer if it's a Mac. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this helps you. Bye-bye.